Look, right now, city officials in Revere are coming up with a plan to address what you see right there on your screen. It's violence breaking out in the halls. Students have gotten into so many fights. Teachers are stepping in and begging for help. NBC 10's Alicia Palumbo has the details now. A shocking fight caught on camera inside the halls of Revere High School last month that ended with an assistant principal injured. There's just too many fights, I don't know, and the school never seems to get on top of it. We don't want a tragedy to happen because we don't have the staff to prevent it. Monday night, the Revere Teachers Association presented a petition to the city council with more than 750 signatures and a list of proposals, including a system to track violent incidents throughout the school year, additional guidance counselors, and more support for their special education system. What we're talking about are behaviors that are cries for help. Instead, the city council proposed hiring more school resource officers, a third-party security company, and even metal detectors. But students and teachers argued there needs to be a more holistic approach. Rather than adults being concerned for health or our mental health or how we were feeling, I saw people calling us animals. I saw people saying that we need to be sent to military school. Even teachers and students who aren't experiencing the violence firsthand say something needs to change so the focus can return to education. If, if the teachers don't feel safe, well, that's an issue. And I believe that what has been happening here seems to be uh, pushed under the rug, so I'm, I'm happy to fight alongside them. The mayor, superintendent, and chief of police plan to discuss all the options brought up at last night's meeting and come forward with their suggestions in the next 30 to 60 days. At Revere High School, Alicia Palumbo, NBC10 Boston.